Hi everyone, it's Fitz with The Daily Delivery. Hope you're doing well. I am doing great. Yeah, I'm talking really fast. I've got a lot to say. YouTube, please subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. Get us over 7,000 as we continue to grow. If you're not subscribing to gopowercat.com or your school's 24-7 site, stay tuned. A special's dropping soon. Maybe today. They just announced it. It's incredible. Details to follow. But if you like Top Gun, if you want Paramount Plus, you're going to want this one. Okay, here we go. It's a pleasure to cover Kansas State football. These are really great young men. And I'll just say that flippantly. They really are a treat. And I know this, I will be shocked, and I'm getting asked this a lot, if anyone sits out the bowl game to prepare for the NFL draft. And contrary to what certain people on ESPN might believe, there are a lot of draft picks on this particular K-State team. Starting with Felix and Udike Uzama, the rush end has been projected as a first round pick by many services. It might be in his personal best interest to sit out the Sugar Bowl and not play against Alabama and possibly get injured, but I'd be really surprised. Deuce Vaughn will play, Julius Brents will play, Cooper Beebe will play, Adrian Martinez will play. I don't know if he's an NFL guy, but he's gonna come back and play. Daniel Green will play. There's more guys too, I'm leaving people out, I realize that. They're all gonna play. Because representing this school, representing each other, representing their coaches is really what they are all about. They're motivated by that more than just the future payday to come. And that's really refreshing in an era when so many guys are sitting out bowl games because maybe they have an agent in their ear advising them that have a bad game or get injured could be bad for your draft status. I personally think walking away from your teammates is a bad look but that's just me. I'm old and times are changing. I really appreciate the fact that K-State will go into this game with everyone on the field if they're healthy. And yeah, they have some injuries, but that's really cool. This game's significant, not just for the school and the fact they're playing Alabama and they're in the Sugar Bowl and they're having such a great season coming off that Big 12 championship. It's really about playing for each other. They want to represent each other. They are a family, they are bonded brothers, and they're gonna give it all, their all, one more time. You know what, that's really cool, and it's really refreshing in this era. But here we go, K-State, Alabama, it's gonna be great. Alabama, second team. We're all higher rated recruits than Felix, two-star, deuce, three-star, and on down the list. It's the mighty against those that ESPN say aren't worth a damn. Bring it on. It's going to be fun. Sugar Bowl, December 31st, New Orleans. Big 12 SEC, the Cats and the Tide.